Right, we telling you people, come on, man. Spiritual is starting to bet in. I've just been going hot and heavy on my channel. I've been feeling so great while dropping my videos. That's what you got to do while you, when you're dropping your videos. you got to feel great. You can't just be feeling down, depressed and stuff while making your videos. you got to be feeling 10-10 all the time. If I weren't feeling 10-10, I wouldn't be dropping videos. Literally. I just try coming here with the best attitude as possible. And yeah, man. But what I realized, bro, like this, this throughout life, bro, just throughout life, I'm telling you, most people in this generation, it's like we're in a whole new gen generation now. Literally, everything's different. Social media is taking over. People are just on a lower vibration than before. And what I realized, bro, is like snakes are like an all-time high, bro. I'm telling you, backstabbers, snakes, and all these people are all-time high, bro. And this is why I tell you to become an introvert and see my attention and just enjoy your own time, bro. Because people will snake you out here, I'm telling you. You give them, give it like a couple months, bro. I'm telling you, not even a couple months, maybe in a couple weeks, bro. They'll fuck you over, bro, somehow, some sort of way. This is why... I tell any guy on see my attention that takes it seriously or chosen being to this. You got to get to a point where you just leave, you where you just close your circle off on people and just don't accept people back into it. You know what I mean? Because I don't know, for me, I don't want to be going back through the same cycles that I was going through before with all these snakes, like deceiving me, speaking about me, slandering me, manipulating my energy and shit. Fucking going up against me secretly. I don't want to have. I don't want to deal with none of that mental shit, bro. You know what I mean? And this is why I just stay out of the way at all costs, bro. You know what I mean? Stay out of the way at all costs and keep myself to myself. And people might say that you're antisocial. You're um. I don't fucking know, bro. Who cares? Who cares about these people's opinions? Who the fuck are they anyway? You know what I mean? Most time they're the fucking snakes that are trying to criticize you in a, in, you know what i mean literally i'm telling you bro leave people to their own devices box most people don't even fuck you like that no way they just want to see how they can benefit off you in some sort of way or you being nice to them for them or some shit i'm telling you that's what people are like bro they just want to feel like they're superior than you or they're above you or something like this, but I'm telling you, people just love to play mind game, play games and um, games with you in this generation. But that's what I realized because I'm telling you, social media is taking over, and that's what people think that that's what people think all about. But you know what I mean? It's like if you don't have a social media, you're no one, bro. Literally, and they'll just treat you. They'll they'll treat you like you're being nice to them for them or some shit, bro. This is why I don't want you associating with any of these Decepticons and these fucking low vibrational people out here because they're just hassle, but I'm telling you, they're hassle. You all know the hassle. You'll you know what I'm talking about when you deal with these sort of sort of people. I've, I've dealt with these people my whole life, bro. Literally, when I was back in my unhealed version, just going around on a low vibration, just hanging out with anyone and anyone, bro, people were showing me their true sides all the time, bro. And I would just let it slide because I was unhealed and just unconscious of how people think like they might do something to you and you'll be like you'll just shrug it off because it's really and truly nothing but they will take it as like oh you let it slide so i'm gonna that's i'm gonna one-up him just like that that's how people are bro that's what I, that's what I, i'm telling you bro i'm telling you man people are fucking snakes bro they click up the ops click up with people that you don't like to slander you and shit I'm telling you, bro, I've seen a, I've seen some weird shit, bro, I'm telling you. And this is why I just tell you to just stick to yourself, stick to your own path, and just enjoy life in your own, bro, you know what I mean? Because, what I mean, enjoy, enjoy life in your own, I mean, just, you can go out and go talk to people, but, man, don't bring them into your fucking circle, bro, you know what I mean? Don't bring them into your life like that. Because, I don't, I don't want you mixed up in no sort of drama or nothing while you're trying to elevate out here. Because that's what a lot of these people just love, bro. Drama, drama, drama. All the time, 24-7. Whoa, whoa, what's the next kind of drama I can get into? What can I do? I'm telling you, bro. That's what people just... They're annoying, bro. I'm 
And this is why I don't say nothing, but I'm telling you. Now that I've got to this point in my journey, I don't say nothing to people, bro. Literally. Well, not don't say... Unless if I don't need to talk, bro. If I need to talk, I'll talk, but... Most time, if I just catch people just on the street or shit, bro, I just... This, I don't say nothing, bro. Literally. Because that's what I realised, bro. You don't want to be friendly to the wrong people out here because I'm telling you, bro, people think you're being friendly to them, bro. And then... When 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 you're being friendly to them, they're like they won't reciprocate. They'll be, they'll think that you're being friendly to them, so they'll treat you a certain type of way. But you know what I mean? I'm telling you, bro, don't be dealing with these people, bro. They have they just play games, bro. They love to play games. I'm telling you, bro, they love games. And for me, bro, I don't like games because they mess with they're playing with your mind, bro. Trying to manipulate you and shit. But yeah, man. Um, oh yeah, man. I'm telling you, snakes. Tell you that everywhere, bro. Everywhere. When you when you raise your vibration and you look at, and you look at the world around you and you escape the matrix, you'll be like, I'm telling you, bro. You'll start to see a lot of people. There's snakes out here. And it's demonic spirits. Because most people don't focus on themselves spiritually. They're just out here just doing anything and anything. So demons can just attach themselves to them to go against us high, vib us high vibrational beings. And this is why I tell you not to just be friends with this anyone and anyone out here. Because you will come across a lot of spiritual attacks, bro, if you're not, if you're not careful. <laughs> Mm. But um Yeah man Because people are not I'm telling you bro people are not really your friends and shit bro then people are not really your friends bro <laughs> I'm telling you friends is not even a word bro don't even I don't even classify no one as a friend no more. Literally, when, maybe like back in the past, I would usually call people my friend, but I don't call no one my friend no more. Reason being, people are turning their back on you, their back on you at any point, but I'm telling you. And imagine if you get kept... And this is what I learned, but because so much people are turning their back on me. It's not just one person, but I've had multiple people just turn their back on me. And this is why I'm telling you, but they'll do it. And why would you want to deal with these sneaky people? Honey? I'm telling you, these people are sneaky, bro. They, they they do so much shit behind closed doors with other people to go up against whoever. I'm telling you, bro, they do such sneakily, bro. Now come around your face, be like the same person like they were around you. You know what I mean? But they're a whole completely different person behind your back, bro. I'm telling you, you got to watch out for these demons, bro. Demons are everywhere out here. Lurking 24 7 to looking for anyone that they can devour, bro. But I'm telling you, this this is the generation I've been living in, Gen Z. I'm telling you, bro, it's fucking social media. I'm telling you, get it's people's egos, bro. Their pride, their their egos. People need it's like people just have big egos out here. They feel like they are someone when they are no one, bro. Like they feel like they are someone because they have a lot of friends, but <laughs> that's what I mean, bro. People think they are someone because they have a lot of friends, but whole time when you have a lot of friends, you're just fucking lost, bro. Literally, most people will tell me that I don't have no friends. You're just lonely. Or you have no one here. I choose to be alone on purpose, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm not. Literally, I'm doing this by by on purpose, but I'm doing this because I want to do it. I can have many friends, but I know. The backlash of really having a lot of friends, bro. Literally, that is. I'm telling you, bro. Your vibration is lows and lows and lows. Literally. But yeah, bro. All these people, these big fucking circles, it's lost, bro. That's why, I just laugh at these people because these people have the most to say about me. Only to see you probably don't even know your fucking self, bro. Literally. And it's crazy because the same people that will be talking about me, I have no friends, this, that. 
are the same people that are watching me today. Like, what? how is this guy still doing this? Literally. How has this guy made it without us? How is he doing this? Do you know what the best part about everything is? When people snake you out. Be it becoming successful and levelling up without them. And looking at these same people again. Fucking snakes, bro. Literally. Look at these same fools again when you level up, bro. They'll look like a lost puppy. They'll be like... I'm telling you, bro. They'll look like one lost puppy. And what I realised, bro, is a big-ass fucking world out here, bro. I'm telling you. Like... You might see people for them, but I'm telling you, when you make like a social media platform and you get like big on there and you see these same people again, it'll be like a whole, they'll, they'll be whole completely different, but I'm telling you, it'll feel, it'll feel different. If, I'm telling you, we live in a big world, bro. Don't just be giving all your time and energy to this one person, all you, all these friends and shit, bro, because I'm telling you, bro, it, it's not worth it. Man, life becomes enjoyable when you have money and goals, bro. Literally, when you have money and goals, bro, life just becomes enjoyable because you can start doing bigger shit. Without folks. And you'll just have fun on your own as well. So you're having fun while you're doing bigger shit on your own. You know what I mean? And this is why I tell you, a lot of you... To travel, man. You need to start travelling. I'm telling you, travelling makes you happy. Oh, uh, uh. Yeah, bro. I'm telling you, bro. People just have big egos, bro. They just think... I'm telling you, bro. Most people think that you're just being nice to them for them, bro. They think you're being nice to them for them. Because they have some... So I don't know. They just like this, bro. And this is why I don't even say nothing to people out here. I'm telling you, I don't say nothing, bro. If I can avoid people, I'll just avoid them completely, bro. I won't say not, not even one word. Because I know people, bro. They're just... Always in some sort of competition or some bullshit, bro, in this generation, literally. This is why I just walk straight past people and act like I don't even know them, bro. You know what I mean? I don't care if I've known you since school. Pr fucking secondary school. It, I don't care how long I've known you for, bro. Literally. Because, as I said, bro, people don't even have the best interest for you, no way, literally. And that's why I just tell you to have, just have zero tolerance to these people and just... I'm telling you. Because most times, these, pe these people, I'm telling you, I've, I've seen it all, bro. I've seen it all. People have zero tolerance to you, literally. I've seen it all, bro. People have zero tolerance to you. People don't care about you, bro, I'm telling you. So, as I said, bro, don't be caring about people when you level up in the future. See, I levelled up from where I was before. People thought I was going to be stuck where I was. Only to see I levelled up. And now, what can they do, bro? They can't do nothing, bro. And I ain't going to be so fucking friendly like before, bro. Literally, when I was in my unhealed version, I was just friendly. Giving my hand out to just anyone. In, not anyone. Just people that I'll see that I'll think were friendly towards me, but they weren't, bro. I'm telling you. This is why I tell you, if you're like a chosen being or like someone on a high days and see my attention... Oh, keep yourself to yourself and just do m m make movements silently, bro. And just enjoy life silently as well. Don't be telling everyone what you're doing, what, where you're going on holiday, stuff like this. Just do it. Just do it, bro. Because as I said, bro, people don't have your best intention anyways. So you might as well just act like you're dead and not even on the fucking radar. And that's exactly what I do, bro. I just play like I'm dead and I'm just... Like, I, I play like I'm dead and I'm like off the radar completely because why the fuck do I, why the fuck do I want you all up in my business anyway? Literally, you're just nosy, bro. I'm telling you, most people just nosy, bro. They don't want to see if you're doing good. They just want to see what you have going on so they can compare themselves to you or some bullshit. Literally, but I'm telling you. And as I said, bro, you never really know these people. That's what I realised, bro. You never know these... You don't know these people, bro. You don't know these people. These people can be smiling in your face, but they have a whole agenda behind in their minds, bro. I'm telling you. I've had friends smile in my face, but they probably had agendas to try to kill me and shit like this. Smile in my face, but they'll still... um, But they'll fucking... 
click up with the ops and shit. Literally, I'm telling you, bro, people are sneaky, bro. They're, they're, I'm telling you, people are like hidden devils out here. For us chosen beings, I'm telling you. That's why I tell you, I'm telling you, most people are like hidden devils, bro. Hey, man, pay attention to this message, bro, because I know what I'm talking about, bro. I've been through the lowest things in my life, and this is why I just express it on the camera, because... I need to get this knowledge and wisdom out to people out there that need to hear this shit, bro. Because if I ever, if something ever does happen to me one day, I know I left a lot behind on this earth that people can look back on and learn something of. Because you ain't gonna learn nothing from these fucking people out in this matrix, bro. They ain't gonna teach you nothing except for how to gossip, slander people, and just betray people, bro. Literally. I'm telling you, the matrix is a. It's the place. <laughs> Now that I've just escaped it, bro, it's just like, I'm telling you, people are trapped, bro. They're, they're, it's like they're trapped. And I'm so happy that I've escaped. Literally, people are trapped in the system. They're just in the world, doing the worldly things. Don't focus on them, don't focus on themselves spiritually or nothing. Literally, I'm telling you, man. This is why I tell you, if you're a spiritual being, you can only click up with people that are on their spiritual path or on that self-improvement path or something like that, bro. And don't be clicking up with just any random guy here that's just doing this anything and anything, bro. I'm telling you because literally... And I'm telling you, I don't try. <laughs> this is why my trust is like so. I don't, bro. I don't be trusting people like that. You know what I mean? Because people are like they're wolves in sheep's clothing. But I'm telling you, they'll they'll attack you when your back's turned. They'll be nice to you one day, you go back to them the next day, and they're a whole completely different character. They're just like whole different devil, literally. Literally, I'm really telling you the truth, bro. Really do pay attention to what I'm telling um telling you. But man, that's it for the video. Make sure you drop me a like and a sub. And drop me a comment down below what you want to um, hear next because, man, drop me... I don't know what you want to uh, hear from me. Just drop it down below and I'll see what I can do. Drop me an email or some shit. I don't fucking know, bro. Literally. But, man, I'm trying my best. You know what I mean? Look how much fucking videos are made in, like, one year, bro. Come on, man. You never... No one... You never see no one like me, bro. No one's ever seen no one like me. I'm telling you. And I know why I had to go up against so much spiritual warfare in my life because I now I see how strong I am. You only see how strong you are when you start to take your access away from people. Now that I took my access away from people, now I see why people are coming up against me so hard now. And I know n never to go back into them situations ever again, literally. But man, take it easy and I'm out. Peace.